Of course, I was caught eating my nachi. Now, nachi is a truly South African word. Um, I'm not actually quite sure. I think, uh, from what I understand, what you guys call nachi, nachis in North America, I'm not sure what they call them in Europe. It's a, it's a, it's a clementine. But I, I'd never heard that word till the other day. Uh, it's like a mini orange, <laughs> but it's easier to peel. But very, very tasty. And one of the nice things about living in the low felt is not very far from us. So it's probably one of the, the biggest fruit producing areas in South Africa. So in this area, we produce a lot of avocados, uh, nachis, oranges, lemons, uh, <coughs> mangoes. Um, what else? Bananas. Bananas. Yes, there is. Jean has got a banana for his his snack while on drive. Uh, Jean -Dre, Jean I don't think I've ever met someone who loves bananas as much as Jean Dre, though. He even sings about them when we're off air. <laughs> Jean Dre, would you like to give us a little verse of your favorite song? Put a banana in your ear. Put a banana in your ear. Put a that is banana right into your favorite ear. It's true, so true. When you're down and feeling blue. Yeah, I said one verse. <laughs> yeah, so the problem is when Jean Dre starts singing, he doesn't stop. Uh, but there we go. There's Jean Dre's favorite song. Put a ripe banana in your favorite ear. How and where this song comes from, I have no idea. Uh, I'm completely flummoxed about what I was going to say it next. It works, I promise you. If you're feeling sad, just put a banana in your ear. There we go. Apparently, if you're feeling sad, put a banana in your ear. 